All right. I think we're up and running. What's up, MRX? How's it going? Hey, you have not um, messaged me about um, the uh, Cap Infinity sticker that I that you won for my birthday stream the other week. What's up with the? There we go. So make sure you go and do that. So I can send that out. Let's see, what do we got? Where do we get an arena? Do you still have time? Of course. Of course you have time. I have actually three three people that I'm still waiting on. Yeah, actually, let's go buy. I gotta claim this stuff. Let me do that really quick. Now that AQ opened up. For setting up. This is what I get. I just get the two tier five class and I get 10 of these. And I think if I can't claim it all. You're in Texas? No, I, I'm paying for everything. I just it's just I just mail it out. It's just in an envelope, it's not a big deal. What am I doing? Here we go. Rewards. Do I have enough to claim this? No, I need to spend a couple. And I'll go get a tier two. Let's see, claim, claim. All right, let me mark this down because I usually, re I usually um, submit to the, um, actually, do I have that? Let's see, if I go to this. Alright man. Yeah, just just send it to my 30k units at Gmail. Alright, so if I go like this. And then I need to just gonna show this real quick. I, I usually record um what is the ranks on these? I usually record my results for the arenas. For the arena bot, or not the arena bot, the arena knights result stuff. Uh, let's see, what was my rank? It was 1595. Seven. And then if we go look at the numbers. Put this in twenty five eighty five two. Submitted. All right. So today, I haven't even touched Eternity of Pain once yet, so we're gonna do some of that. Is that Mr. Thing? That is Mr. Thing, it's me. 
We're gonna knock out a little bit of this. I only have, I think, a few paths left in this event quest. This is the uncollected. Um, and then I'm gonna go in and do some some runs, see if we can't get a solo or two or three on this Modoc. I haven't touched it yet. And I have I have some decent counters to use. So Alright, we're gonna throw your special, we're gonna just build up our furies. Alright, here we go. Oh, he, uh, his armor ups prevented the stun. I wasn't expecting that. There we go. You took thing to rank two today? Nice. Yeah, I'm, I'm just questing here. I have the full Fantastic Four team. Um, and She-Hulk team I like to use a lot. Um, so I got Thing and Torch now at rank 4. Mr. Fantastic at rank 3. And I just have a 5 star Invisible Woman at rank 4. She-Hulk to rank two. She-Hulk, she's good. And I'll tell you what, that Titania, whoo, she looks nutty. She looks nutty. And as a guy that loves science champs, she looks really interesting. She looks like my kind of champ. Um, the number of debuffs that she can put out is just insane. There was like, in that deep dive, there was like three full stacks of debuffs. So there was like, you can get what, six on a row? There's 18? Just nasty. Can't imagine like, some of, some of the nose where you can just, yeah, get that going. A little bit distracting and whatnot, but. All right, let's just smash this guy. Let's, let's go with Thing. Here, we're gonna go and apply all these. For the first time, SP1 did like, yeah, I mean, you, if you can build up her Furies, especially against like, um, large champs, um, she can, she can put out some crazy damage with all those furies and whatnot. Harvest me? Come on. Oh, I forgot this guy has limber. No, oh, I can't nullify his um, unstoppable. Forgot he's immune to that stuff. like crazy what oh that was his power sting like wait how did he die <laughs> I have power stings hey brother why the name 30k units um I'm not sure how to pronounce your name Bane GVSD um 30k units comes from the movie Guardians of the Galaxy. I'm a big fan of Guardians of the Galaxy in the shows. Um, and in that movie, there's a part where where uh, Star-Lord and Drax and Rocket and Groot and Gamora, they're all trying to... Um, they're all trying to escape the, the jail. Um, 
and uh, she er, Rocket tells Star Lord that you know they're they're telling like what kind of stuff they need to do and whatever to get to get out and on the side uh, Rocket tells Star Lord that he needs some guy's prosthetic leg and um, he ends up getting it and when he gives the prosthetic leg to rocket as they're escaping from the jail he's like what is this he's like it's the prosthetic leg you asked for and rocket was like oh, i was just joking and um uh, i'm not paying attention hey what's up you want, milk. you want chocolate milk all right hold on i gotta get my daughter some chocolate milk i'll be right back All right, I'm back. Let's eat the let's eat the special three. But yeah, so he, he Star Lord ended up paying thirty thousand units for um, a prosthetic leg. I just think that was really funny. A funny scene. I like I like Guardians of the Galaxy and like the humor in it. Um, but yeah, that's that's the background be, behind the name thirty K units. And I like to grind units and uh, save them up by like the big special offers um that come out on like fourth of july and black friday cyber weekend stuff like that so that's that's what's behind the name of my channel so yeah what's that you also like hurt not just units <laughs> Herc's okay. He's an okay champ. We might actually we might actually use Herc for this um, Eternity of Pain. There's like a cosmic objective or whatever. But I also just took Hyperion to rank three. He's still unawakened. But I'm also considering trying him out. Sit sit Herc on the bench. Excited to see. Okay, well, we will um, we will get there in just a moment. I think I just have. Well, we can probably we can actually probably just go straight there after this path. I've used used enough energy. I'll pop a refill to finish. Used Hurt for the boss in Alliance War as a bishop. Nice. And if you can keep pushing, ideal to keep pushing him to a special two. And then just kind of nuke him down. We don't get to use Hercules in Alliance War this season in tier one. He's banned. Torch is also banned, so I don't get to use him. And But I actually have mine on, on defense. So... But I, I like using a little bit of everybody. Like this last war, I had two thing fights, which were pretty just like easy, normal stuff. And then I had two Sim Supreme fights, were, which were pretty fun. And then I had a another Yellow Jacket versus Doctor Doom Conflictor mini boss. That was pretty fun. So.
How many rank fours do I have? I have seven. I have seven rank fours. Um, I have Hercules. I have Thing and Torch. Doom. Surfer. And Void. Is that all? Is that all seven? Because I have three science, so I have Thing. Yeah, Thing, Torch. And Void, Doom, Surfer and Hercules. Oh, and then Nimrod. That was six. So yeah, and then Nimrod. There we go. Went down from. Platinum four to gold one, but the good thing is that you can use. <laughs> I guess that's a good thing. I think I actually didn't look to see. We so we won this last war. I haven't even looked to see here after after we finish after we finish this um, this guy off. Let's see where we went up in the rankings. Uh, let's see. Here, we're gonna go, I'm gonna try She-Hulk on this guy. Throw all these on, I gotta just remember that there's um, Limber, right? Yeah, all right. I have, I have not done the EOP, we're gonna do that like pretty much right after this boss is done. Mm -hmm. That's not gonna work. But we're gonna get there. We will get there. We're gonna get harvested for sure. See, we can't sting this guy to death. There we go. All right. So, yeah, I just want to, let's check out, let's check out what we got. I have one more path to do and then I'm all the way done with Cavalier. Or actually, should I do Cavalier, should I do this last pass so I can just be done with it? Yeah, it's the arena stuff, I already collected that. Here, let me just, let me just finish this one last path. And then we'll, we'll jump in to eternity of pain. Uh, where is it, this one? Yeah, here we go. How do you, how do you say that? Is that maz maz, maze maze? How do you, how do you pronounce that? I like, the, I like the Deadpool icon. So Bane, if you're still here, oh, this one has the, uh, you gotta throw a special. If I have you knocked down. I have, so this has like the node that um, this MODOK has, right? So if I knock down, what is that called? Uh, down and out. Yeah, we gotta throw a special. Bane, how many rank fours do you have? Or anybody else in the chat? I'm curious who, who, how many you have and, and who you took. EOP rewards are great, but it's painful. You think so? I don't think it's that painful. Um, I mean, to be honest, like, in prior weeks, prior eternity pains, the last two, you know, I've, posted some of my videos as like solos and stuff but generally I don't get them on the first try and there's there I think there's one or two that I got just went in and soloed with a champ but uh, you know it takes a little bit of work it's got a big enough health pool to where 
the fights are generally long enough to where you know you make mistakes and whatnot but the nice thing is with pretty much all of the eternity of pain fights is you know if you're not all that concerned about getting solos and stuff which really don't matter um you know you can throw a revive or two at a fight and get it down and you get the same rewards as everybody else that showcase off a, a you know a solo or whatnot so 7.3 got 11 pass left nice be more welcome to the stream you have two rank fours herc and apoc your third is going to be sunspot you're going to rank four sunspot i can appreciate that i think sunspot is an amazing champ um and I think he often gets overlooked. Oops. She purified that stun. And that one. Dirty. Oof. All right, she gotta throw this because oh, we got stun. That's right, get some willpower healing. There, she's dead. Sunspot's your favorite champ, not thing or her. That's cool. I I really like Sunspot. Like he's he's really good. I I kind of feel bad that he got kind of shafted on the prestige for the rank fours, but. Um, He's really, he's really good. His damage output is insane. As long as you don't have to deal with shocks or the, the opponent's incinerate immune, like, he just will really shine in pretty much any fight. I should have, I should have put on the flame on for this one. All right, throw a special and kill yourself. Power sting. Maybe. Uh, not quite. Oh. We got good luck. Eleven pass left and seven point three. So that's not. It's not too bad. You're gonna. Just around the corner, you'll be all ready for eight point one releasing. Which I'm pretty stoked about. Yes, that's exact. You know, I do. I do like some champs that are that are a little bit more like complicated in, you know, managing their rotation and stuff. Like I really like Surfer. I know he's not for everybody though, but like Surfer is a really solid champ. But yeah, you're exactly right. Like Sunspot is just so easy to use, and. To me, it's kind of like thing. He's kind of like thing. Um, granted, he has more damage output. Thing just has like a little bit more on the utility survivability. Um, but yeah, sunspot. Sunspot can nuke some stuff down pretty easily. All right, we're almost done. Last pat. This is last last gallon. All right, let's let's go in with. Let's just see if we can flame on and nuke him down here. We have Mr. Bald as a six-star dude, rank still rank one. Are you talking about um, Kingpin? All right, throw special. Nice, almost dead. Just gonna block that crap. Ooh, he harvested mid combo. Ooh, 
got me. I'm having issues fully dexing that special one. I need to practice that a lot. I know like Tiger can just go right through it, but I need to be able to learn how to dex it. Oh, Silver Surfer is Mr. Bald? I see. Yeah, I guess he's bald too. All right, so we're done with EQ. All of all of Event Quest is done. I've completed all the modes. I'm gonna have to go and do some um, more paths to get the solo objective later on. I'll probably do that maybe towards the end of the stream or off stream. Probably go practice on the Cavalier one because I got to do, yeah, there's, got a lot of points to get. So, I was gonna check Alliance War. Season, where are we at? Oh nice, we're up to 14. Sweet. Who's still number one? JA, they beat us. GT40, made in Brazil. TCN, they beat us. And then I, don't know, I guess all the other people that we've beat are in platinum. So we beat Lapis, Magneto, and we just beat New Nation. It's unfortunate because they, these guys, they, they weren't trying. They weren't trying. These other ones were they were trying it was a real war all right so we're gonna do eternity pain so if i go look so i need to do raw damage and just make a little note for myself if i can get my pen to work so i need a raw damage i need a mercenary and i need a cosmic So, let's start out with, let's see, where's the tags, 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 raw damage, who do we got, so we got Herc, Sunspot, Guillotine, Aegon, no, Kingpin, Elsa, I actually might just try Elsa for this one, because she is not, she's not mercenary, right, or is she, I can't remember, no, she's just a hero, let's try Elsa, because I know Elsa can do really well, and I like, I like using Elsa. See if I can't get a solo. Um, I'll be checking in on chat between fights. I'm not gonna try to get too distracted because I know it only takes a quick distraction to get lit up. All right, so true strike, true, true accuracy is turned off. Basically, that doesn't matter for Elsa. Light him up. So this is, so if I can keep him incinerated, I can just bypass the auto block, power from far. He's gonna get a lot of the power gain when I'm away from him. If I knock him down with a heavy, gotta use a special and won't be doing heavies really. On the brink, when the defender blocks a hit, they gain an indefinite fury and they become unblockable. Okay, obstinate charge. Yeah, they're stun immune on the first one. Okay, and then Tranquility. So we can use Tranquility to our advantage for removing like the power from afar, power gain, and all that kind of stuff. All right, so let's see. Angel can stop the auto block and fit two objectives. Yeah, I, there is lots of champs that can fit two objectives. Um, 
Angela is not one that I have ranked up. I think I just have her as a rank one unawakened six star. And I have um, what's her name? Um, here, I'm going to do this. Can we get the power drain? Yes. Ooh, that hurt. Yeah, that was a fail. Um, yeah, there's a lot. I'm not, I see, I'm not going to revive. I have revives. I'm going to try to get a couple solos. And if I can't get them, I'll throw a few revives in. But we'll try a few times. See if we can't get the flow, flow down on this. weird playing off. I'm playing off to the side and I got this cord hanging on to um, Black Widow. Yeah, don't got her. Um, I'm usually not when I'm like record when I'm playing serious I usually don't have uh, my phone connected and my phone is feeling really dang hot right now too. I'm gonna parry, I gotta re-parry because of the uh, whatever note that is. All right, all right. We're gonna get a good run. need to start doing um not that I need to do some more draft back intercepts All right, I'm out of charges. I 
Oh. I just threw the special one and I got drained. Oh, no, 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 no. There we go. No, 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 no. All right. All right. I got to be a little bit more careful on trying to apply the incinerates with that auto block. Damn. All right. We're getting the flow. We're getting a little bit of the flow. We'll get this. like stopped on that counterattack. Special three here. Yep. All right. I don't need to watch this. All right. All right. All right. Let's go. I wish my Elsa was awakened. What's going on, Neen? Welcome. Welcome, welcome. This Elsa is in the arena soon. Combat on this, I feel like I'm not getting the power that I normally would.
Oh, you're special. Thank you. Come on, man. Not getting in a good rhythm, that's for sure. All right, all right. I just feel like my combat power rate is low. I don't know. Like getting to a special one on this one just seems. Special or not? All right, we got a special, and maybe it's just I'm not doing enough hits for each uh oh my gosh each cycle <laughs> each the, the tranquility cycle mm. all right terrible terrible we're gonna keep trying a little bit i can get this i just gotta get into a good flow and i have not got there yet because I got the incinerates no. coming right out of the drain. Oh my gosh. Mm. I don't know that I've actually even fought MODOK much ever with Elsa. forgetting about the repairy with a little cleanse thingy going on all right there we go Incinerates. Oh my gosh. Mm. 
Not looking good. Four percent. All right, no more blocking. So yeah. Ugh. All right, we can do better than that. Like I just felt like I was just hitting him a bunch and I wasn't gaining any power. Next blocked hit. He's gonna go unblockable. Very special. Incinerates ready. There we go, got one. Totally missed that. Let's see, yo, White Widow is easy for that MODOK. Yeah, if you have her. And Grinfield, you're also another one. Grinfield, MRX, and Solidus. Solidus hasn't showed up, but um, I never, you never contacted me about um, getting your sticker, which I have down as the King Group. So make sure you do that so I can send that out if you have forgotten. Have you seen the new Kabam mic? Yeah. You know, the weirdest thing, I, I have no issues with karate mic um, working, you know, doing work for um, Kabam. What I just thought was really weird was, oops, was I felt like he was trying to be um, Dorky Diggity Dave in that that video. I, know, I just thought it was kind of weird with his voiceover and stuff. Have him incinerated. Reparry. We're hitting to his block. There we go. Incinerate. OK. 
Okay. I don't know, what did you guys think about the deep dive videos with uh, Karate Mike doing them? All right, I don't have an incinerate to give yet. Throw it. Your special one. I don't need it. No. What? What? I thought I had my counter available. probably did it on purpose but why it just it just didn't sound right it didn't feel right you know what I mean like like when it first started up I was like oh this is not this is not Dave but it sounded like somebody was trying to be exactly like Dave I guess is is my thing which I just thought was weird I don't know. Maybe I'm being a little bit too critical, but uh, it just seemed weird. All right, sweet. We got an incinerate off at the end of that. No more incinerates left. That's the one thing that is a little bit annoying with um, Elsa. Is that her incinerate... Oh, I just got blasted. Her incinerates kind of run out. they didn't all right we're gonna oh get auto blocked and died you can only only so much you can do reading from a script when you can't constantly say dude and affirm your assertions <laughs> uh yeah but i'm a I, I'm making assumptions. I'm making assumptions. Is that Karate Mike gets to dictate and write what that script is. Right? Alright. Come on, let's get a better showing on this big headed dude. I 
need him to... I don't know, am I... I just feel like he's not being as aggressive as I would like with the... Oh, crap. And the specials? The special throwings? I was, I was just about to say, right when I felt like he was getting better with throwing, I missed the L1 decks. Let's see. You don't think so? The deep dives are cookie cutter, so someone is in control of the script? You think so? I don't know. I don't know about that. Is the Ant-Man buff come tomorrow, or is it Tuesday? It's, it's whenever you update the... It's whenever you update the game. So I'm assuming sometime tomorrow afternoon um, you will... Uh, I mean, I gotta kill this dude. You can, you can get the update in the store. One thing that I've noticed is if he auto-blocks on... The counter. Oops. That um, he will not be able to keep countering the combo, if that makes sense. Out of incinerates, where we don't have our counter charge. All right, now we got it. What? See, what? What? I swear. Yeah. So he can. So he cannot. So if I counter, I can just keep keep comboing into him. I did not realize that. I swear I countered that where I just got lit up, or I parried it. Sometimes the update comes on Tuesday. Sometimes. Sometimes it comes on Monday. Just whenever the update comes out is when you get the Ant-Man buff. Otherwise, uh, you won't have the game file stuff. Come on, throw, throw. And not get hit. Dang. Wait, what? I swear I am parrying to activate the counter attack and that one I didn't because I didn't have it and I just screwed up wow all right all right how many times have we done this I feel like I'm on this like broken record I feel like I need somebody with uh, more easy access to All right, so see, like, right there, I could just combo right through the counter. Throw. Thank you. We're just going to burn them up here. Get them drained. <laughs> Use the counter. Just... I can't combo right through him. Alright. No 
incinerates. Come on. All right. I really wish my Elsa was awakened. But she gets more damage against big champs, I think. If I'm not mistaken. Set again. I don't know what's up with him just like holding block. No counterattack, no incinerate at the moment. Alright, here we go. Finish those combos in the corner. He is, um, just going into block. Oh, no, <laughs> let's see, big or science, depending on. Ammo. Is that what it is? Oh! How many hits was that? Let's see, I'm gonna look back on the replay thing on here. I had a hundred and. Mm, my replay thing is kind of pretty far behind. hundred and something hits. Let's see, live. It's like 180 hits. Oh, here, I'll try again. I'm gonna try again. I'll try to get a solo. I can get a solo with this girl. At least I think I can. I like that. Hold into block. Come on, throw. I don't know what what. <sighs> I thought it was. I thought I was gonna get uh, 
tranquility on that. <laughs> All right. I wonder how long have I, st how long ago did I start? This guy. Just loving to block me. All right, no more incinerates. There we go. All right, we should. <laughs> 37 minutes all right so all right on the hour if if i haven't gotten him on the hour i'm just gonna go on a decent run and then i'm gonna switch to something else and finish it off with the with the item or whatever i swear i landed a parry on that because i can parry even when he's unblockable good start. Not a good start at all. Throw. Alright, see so he's unblockable. See, we can counter. And get hit in the face. 37 minutes of failure? Hmm. I thought I was going to be able to get in a little bit better of a rhythm on this one, and I really haven't. I had a couple decent runs, but nothing, nothing great. What's up with him blocking like that? All right, we're gonna get tranquility going, maybe. Yeah. All right, so like we can hit through that. We will trigger. Hit into the block though, which is fine. Come on. Fine. Don't throw your special. I just feel like 
I don't know, maybe maybe I'm just missing parries or whatever, but I feel like I'm parrying at the same time when he's unblockable versus not unblockable. I have to look at some other this is this is just a um, this is the raw damage option. All right, we got a beta special two here. No bullets. No bullets. Oh, and there I there I did not have a counter. Now I have a counter. And again, I couldn't parry that. All right, next next decent run that gets half or more. I'm just gonna continue onward with that, or I just try somebody else. Maybe I should just try somebody else. Maybe I should just try somebody else. All right, we've activated courage. Let's go. Throw your special. Hey, there we go. Ugh, wasted. Alright, I'm gonna back out. Let's see let's see what other raw damage chance we have because I am not I'm not feeling it. It's not working out well. Where's my filters? There we go. All right, raw damage. <laughs> Here, let's just try Sunspot. I think he might actually run out of charges, depending on how we play it. Here we go, Louie. Here's Sunspot. Throw that. So if we throw, he yeah, I haven't been throwing heavies. I can't really throw heavies like I normally would with this dude. All 
Okay, so we got three solar flares. Let's rebank all that. Alright, he's unblockable. Oof. Alright. I didn't I didn't look at anybody's videos, but I know let's see, if I do a heavy, I have to throw a special. I can get some power gain. But at the same time. How do I how do I get effectively up to a special two? with this guy. Without getting hit in the face like that. <laughs> hmm. Because the playstyle that I normally use with Sunspot, I don't know how well it's going to work here. Let's try. Let's try this. Not get clipped. Not sure what the what the flow is for this. I'm not sure I like. I don't know. I gotta figure this out. If I can parry. Heavy. I don't think I'm going to be able to get to special two. Maybe. Maybe right here. No. No. No special two there. I'm gonna run out of solar or incinerates.
Yeah, I'm out. That was decent enough. All right, I'm just gonna revive that because I feel like unless I can get to a huge special two, I'm not putting on any boost or anything. Let's see, what does my inventory look like? I got those couple revives. I don't think I have like any or many health pots. Got a few. Maybe I should throw on some of these boosts. I have what? Attack and health and attack. All right, let's do this. We're gonna go. Twenty percent revive. Yeah, I got a lot of revives. And don't exit. Use boosts. We'll put on a ten and a ten. We'll just see if we can't finish him off right here with 20%. We shall see. Might take might take more than one, but we'll see. an absolute waste but that's okay round two or round three And I'm now I'm just eating them. So raw damage, check. Mercenary, mercenary. Let's see. All right. There's one eternity of pain. I'm going to claim that. And all right. So mercenary. I'm trying to think. Mercenary. Who to use? Here's the tags. Mercenary. Uh, probably gonna use Misakri. We should have easy access to incinerates and damage. Light them up, power from afar, knock them down. So we gotta be careful on when we use heavies, if any. All right, let's go.
sure he's getting melted. Hmm, back to scratch. Let's get some deep wounds going, maybe. Not yet. Whew! What the heck? After all that work with trying with Elsa and Sunspot, and then I get something like that first try. All right. Mercenary done. Okay. That was, that was nice. So now we gotta do a cosmic. Cosmic, cosmic, cosmic. Now, who to use? So I just took a pipe. I'm gonna try him out. He's ranked three, he's unawakened. Can't do a lot of heavies. Unless I know I'm gonna connect a special one, which can be a little bit sketchy depending on if I have any incinerates up. And I'm gonna try him a bit. And then if, if he's too painful, then I will, uh, I will try with um, Hercules. Burn, nice. Oh, uh, he's, um, his special one is reversing my power gain. Come on. Burn, 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 burn before the auto block. Nice. Yeah, I'm getting, I'm getting burnt. I shouldn't have done that, I don't think. I had to do that, otherwise I'm gonna take big damage. Ugh. Mm, no failed intercept. Uh, 
turn. Yes. Yeah, I don't know that I want to try hype on Awakened. I feel like I need more power gain and I'm getting it reversed. I don't want a heavy. Let's go Cosmic, edit team. <laughs> I know CGR could do it. Proxima. Here, I'm just gonna throw Proxima in there and let's see how well she can possibly do. I don't think it's gonna be good because I won't be, able, I, I can probably com complete missions, but getting to a special two is probably gonna be not possible. All right, we got a parry mission, okay. Ugh, get hit mission. Hold on, restart. Just gonna, I, I like using Proxima. We'll see. I don't think she's gonna do very well though. Cause I know, I know that the, um, her true strikes bumbo jumbo it doesn't work ooh that was not a good idea yeah no i'm not going to try proxima cuz i forgot about her heavy knockdown mission and i don't if that comes up first or second or whatever i don't feel like I feel like it's gonna be too much to work around. All right, let's just try Hercules, I guess. Cosmic, anybody else I'm missing? There's a rank for Angela. All right, let's try Herc. Let's try Herc. All right, we gotta be careful on the knockdown, heavy knockdown stuff. And just getting hit, okay. keep blocking I guess sure uh, no, we'll, we'll just we'll keep practicing this mm, all right now I have I'm immortal yeah yeah hit me so what I know my immortality is going to go away. That stun's going to go away. That's right. So if I intercept, I can hit, keep hitting through. Oops, I can keep hitting through that. So if I intercept him, first hit will hit potentially, or the second will get auto-blocked, but I, then I can just keep going through it, is, if I remember right, kind of like the Elsa counter evade. We'll see. Let's see if I can get into a flow with her. No, I didn't want a heavy. Did not want a heavy. I usually start out with heavies. Just using Herc. Mm. Right. Mm, 
can't block unblockables. Intercepting. I should be. Uh, I think I just not need to do specials. Might as well get the damage in. No, nope, not anymore. Mm -hmm. All right, super scroll. Nah, super scroll. I don't. He's unawakened. So I won't get the power gain. I won't get I won't get the special I won't get the special two for the incinerates. I think frequently, if ever. With all the auto blocks and the shenanigans that Modoc has. I don't know if I if I if I can intercept while he gets. I think that's the key to consider in this. Is I wish there was a timer as to when the auto block would come up. Because then I could time intercepts like that to where you can just full combo through it. Whoops. Whoops. Yeah, sure, get hit, get hit, get hit, get hit. Let's just quit. That was garbage. He doesn't need incinerate. He has undermine. Undermine, I have never... Um, uh, Hold on a second. Let me just bring that up. So if I go... Let's bring this up. Where's my web browser? Right here, I'll show it. Aunt May, Champion, uh, Super Scroll right here. Okay, I don't get the power gain, but here we go. So we got passive, yeah, yeah, yeah. Four plus fury buffs gain an undermined debuff for 15 seconds, granting unblockable to any hit which auto blocks the opponent. Interesting. Hmm. I will consider that. Let's see. Hide that. So if he gets his furies, which you either have to intercept or, I mean, I don't want to be hitting into his block a lot to get him unblockable. I, st I still don't think, I mean, I... Hits like a little sissy too. Super scroll. Especially if you can't incinerate. Alright, so there we can just full combo. Intercept it.
mean, Herc's working. See if I can, if I could, if I had a timer that showed me like when that auto block was gonna come back up, be super nice. So I could work around uh, my combos and whatnot. Oh my goodness. Work around my combos to line up with that popping up and then getting the intercepts in. All right, we can get this down with her. All that is true, but someone needs to use him. <laughs> I, I might here when after I finish after I finish him off with with Hercules, I'll 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 give um uh, I'll give uh, Super Scroll a run for his money. See, like, I'm doing these combos, and I wish I knew when that auto block was going to come back up. I will say, he is super aggressive when he's unblockable. It's kind of like he has... Um, Aggression Fury up. special one off oh let's get some adrenaline No, 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 no. All right, we're not, we can't take any more hits and we just took a hit. <sighs> All right, so we've gotten like two thirds off a couple of times, not two thirds, one third left, two thirds left. All right, we can do better, we can do better. We gotta build up the feats earlier too. Gotta build up the feats earlier. Especially since I'm not going to be doing these knockdowns. Unblockable. Next one, right here. All right, we'll extend this out. He's gonna throw the special one or special two. Come on, intercept. Oh, 
Oh, he's unblockable. Dang it. Alright, we got a cruelty. Oh, we got auto blocked. We got wrecked. And we're getting wrecked some more and some more. Alright. We got some health to deal with. To work with. You know what, I'm just gonna, how many revives do I got that are like expiring? I'm just gonna throw a couple revives at this guy and be over with it. And then we can try super scroll. So, one, two, three, four, five, six, I got like a couple. All right. Revive. All right, let's see what we can do with that. 20%, he's at 52%. All right. Close. There's my mortality. I like fighting him when he's unblockable. A little bit more predictable in his movements. Here we go. Just gonna make him go unblockable. into the block. No! Oh! I was like, one more hit into the block, you're going blockable, and I just messed up over there in the corner. Yeah, I think, I think that is the key, is if you get him unblockable, he's just like, he's just like the Oscillate Fury. Super aggressive. Outside of that, he's, eh, I mean, he's not like armor passive but man he's um he's pretty aggressive in that fury
All right. Well, we're all done. We got one solo. Used a what? Two revives or three revives on Sunspot and two revives on Hercules. Definitely can get solos, but not today. Not today. But let's collect this last one and then let's go back in with Super Scroll per Coat Hanger's request and actually see what he could possibly do. So, Coat Hanger is talking about. When we go into Cosmic Overload, if we have four or more Furies, we gain an Undermine, granting an unblockable to any hit which the opponent auto blocks. So I, you know, I've never really even used that or looked at that. So we need to um, we need to get Furies, which basically means we need to hit into his block. to get the undermine, because we need four and we can't block much. We don't want to get the armor ups. We'll, we'll give it a try. Gotta stop getting hit. That would help. I'm gonna lose all my boss here. I mean, to be honest, it's actually working not bad. No, 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 don't get wrecked. Whoa, we gotta see, watch out for a quadruple raid. Quadruple raid, holy smokes. Solidus, J. Will, Buddy Lee, Lefty, and Enzo. Welcome everybody to um, my stream. We just finished getting the objectives and we're just trying out. That was my first try on Super Scroll. I actually think he could do pretty well. Um, so we got Grenfell, Tobias, Arson, Dextrous, J. Will. Dude, what's going on, guys? Everyone, thank you for swinging by. We're just we're just messing around now with. Um, whoops. Uh, EOP, I should not have finished that. We can't get the Undermine now because we can't get four Furies. So one thing that I felt like I discovered um, too late is that when you get this guy to his Furies, um, oops, all right, let's start that over. If you get him to his Furies, where he's unblockable, he's like predictably super aggressive and I think a lot easier to play, even though he's fully unblockable. This is because you know what's coming. When he's outside of that, whether he's aggressive, whether he's going to throw the special ones, or just sit there like a little doofus in the corner and hold block, 
All right, we got the undermined. All right, let's let's just go town. That's not what we wanted. Ooh, we get <laughs> we do get a free pass with the uh, that falter. All right, all right, all right. Let's try it. Let's try it. Let's try again. Let's get a get a better takedown. I. I Wag one bra, Y two user. What's up? So Jay, well, I th I think I saw you were doing um, in incursions. How did that go? All right, here we go. No, miss an intercept. All right. Let's see. Hey, Mad Dog, doing my first run on Abyss and Karina's at the same time, Path 1 for Challengers. Uh, Jay will no comment. So what, like Sector 7 or something? Um, Path 1 for Challengers. You can do Path 1 for Challengers. I did a 3-5 or 5-3. Let's see, let me bring this up. I have a map that I can look up. Where is that? Abyss. So you're going straight path one, the yellow path, the easy path. I went path, let's see. Um, can I make this bigger on my end a little bit? Yeah, so I went path five and then three. No, that was mutant. For the Karina challengers, what one did I go? I think I went. No, I did go path. I did go path one the whole way. You forgot what happened. <laughs> Mild case of am amnesia, huh? Yeah, path three with five was good for the challenger. So for the challenger, I don't know who you have on your team. So for me, I used. Let me see, who did I use? I used Mole Man, and this was pre, pre nerf. Um, and I actually used Mole Man quite a bit because I had 20% revives, like uh, plenty. Um, and I'm trying to find my results for that. Let's see, in humans. Where did I put that stuff? I'm trying to remember who I had on the team. Karina 2.0, here we go. So, yeah, so I used Mole Man, Guillotine 2099, Falcon, Morningstar, and Void. Um, and I did Path 1. So I think I used, I think I used Mole Man on thing and then like when he was super low health yeah i'll go back to your video don't have mole man but i was thinking long shot instead of morning start no long shot long shot is good um is a good alternate morning star you know she's she she soloed a couple fights and yeah i do have my whole i think i have my whole run on or maybe it's just the end of the run. I think I might just have the end. I stream the end of it. Um, but Morningstar soloed and can solo a couple fights. Um, like she can solo the... I ramped her up on Medusa. She can solo the Captain Marvel movie. Um, I used a revive on Venom the Duck with Morningstar. Hyperion was a nightmare because my Morning Star was the six star Sig twenty. If you have a higher Sig Morning Star, it's better. But Longshot can do that. Longshot can do 
the Venom, the Duck. Longshot can do the Morning Star, or not the Morning Star, the Captain Marvel. Um, should be able to do the Champion. I soloed Cole with Morning Star. Uh, Longshot can do that. Yeah, let's see. But yeah, you can. I know long shots pretty pretty solid. And I don't know who else is on your team. Let me hide this. Warlock better than Guillotine. Um. It it all depends. Um, I actually soloed. I soloed Omega, and I soloed Ghost with Guillotine. Um, I I got uh, Guillotine ramped up at the very last part of thing. Was able to solo Omega and end with a special three. I was able to solo Ghost um, because I started with a hundred, um, but. After that, there wasn't a ramp up fight, and without without the ramp up, Guillotine is is gimped quite a bit. I think I think Warlock can do just as good. So it just really depends on who you like playing. But um, yeah, and definitely if you're going path one versus path three five, yeah, Warlock does really well against Bishop. So it all just depends. Let's hide this. Here, I'm gonna give a couple more shots at at just trying um, super scroll if I can't get into a decent rhythm, just for fun. Um, but this is your first path, so this is like your first first path. Um, I feel that's a little bit tough. Collector, good luck, sir. Good luck. We're gonna get the undermine. So now he won't auto block just for a little bit. Ooh. I didn't feel like I dexed that, but I did. I mean, I'm doing okay at the moment. And I can definitely see um I can definitely see Super Scroll doing this fight. It's long. You can get into this little rhythm. And if you can play nice when he's um Whoops. Uh, and I see got now I got two armor ups, so now I can't even get the undermine. 
Ooh, I got roasted. All right. Super scroll number one cosmic confirmed. I mean, I think that's I think that's good enough evidence. 100 hits. I mean, basically, I had to do that three times over. That was what like 25% health. You know, I don't. Who else has undermine? I'm trying to think who else has the undermine um, access to the undermine buff. To be honest, I don't think I've ever really thought about that one much. My super scrolls on defense right now in Alliance War. Um, so I don't really use them much. Sometimes he gets kills. All right, so Eternity's done. Um, what I'm going to do is I'm going to go Science Combat whatever I'm going I need to get some points in event quest so let's go to un, so I'm done with all modes all modes are there's cavalier 100% uncollected 100% masters 100% heroic 100% normal so most points are gained from 3.2 and I got some refills to churn so what is the undermine might just be super scroll? I th yeah, I think you're right, but I'm, I'm trying to think. I thought maybe there's somebody with like a synergy or something. Let's see, what do we have on these paths? These are science. Science, we want a power sting or weakness. <laughs> Who should I try on the boss? I need to get some practice on the boss. On this, um, whatever, gallon. Limber. Let's go. Power stings, power stings. So if we do these two. Here, I'm gonna go and just throw in a Tigra, because I know I can do it with Tigra. I'm gonna practice one time with Tigra, and then we're gonna try some other options. I actually might try Rintra, because I think we just gotta do like three runs through. Gore, yeah, Gore, I think, I think that's where, I think Gore does have access. That sounds right. Where's my Tigra? Let's use that one. Or actually, let's see, yeah, let's use that one. More health. More health. Yeah, I think you're right. I think Gore. All right, let's see. Does there anything that has an item on here? We got some health pots. All right, health pots. Yeah, we'll go there. So we're going to get some points and some units. So we got, what was this, power stings? All right, so we just get, if we just parry, we get the, we get the benefit of the node and get the petrifies, right? Or no, there it is, a knockdown, we could do a not happy knockdown. Is it Gore? It's it's a double R. It's G O R R. But I'm not a spelling teacher, so I'm not gonna worry about it too much. I have I have a um, an alliance mate. He may or may not be watching, probably not watching, but he always spells Penny, Penny Parker with two N's, like it's like Penny Pasta or something, and I've never said anything just because I don't care. I make spelling mistakes all the time.
All right. We're burning through a path. All right, let's go. Let's just keep going torch. We'll do torch through a run on a lane. He's my newest rank four. And I'm not, uh, I'm not getting to use him a lot because we have him on defense. Which sounds stupid. But he's a global. If you do get hit and you mess up on this guy, you'll get you'll get roasted pretty good. And he's perma banned on attack, so I haven't heard into go ran into Gordon Alliance before, but he here is a beast on defense. Um, he can be. Depends on who you use and where he's at. Um. So in the off season, I learned my lesson. Somebody put him on hazard shift and my team was Thing, Nebula, and uh, somebody else that can do hazard shift, Penny Parker. His yeah, it's Penny Parker. And um, he was on the hazard shift stun immunity mini boss on the island and None of none of those none of those champs can do him well. You can get you can get some crazy damage with like the shocks and or the incinerates, but like because they're techs, uh, well not just because they're techs, but they don't have any way of um, like heal blocking him or preventing his heal. And I think I. I just was using my like one loyalty revives um, and I just kept going back in. I could do like half to 60, maybe 70% with like Nebula, sweet war match found, um, or I get, I get about the same, somewhere between 50 to 70% and then he would just heal it all back. I get like one big special two from either of them, but his regen was so potent from just the hits. It was it was pretty nasty, and I think I think I just ended up seeing. Oh, I didn't realize that this would be the interaction, and um, I think we just had somebody come back in with Quake and finish it off. Cause like I just I couldn't do it, and I tried to I tried to do it with Thing just hitting into his block. But if I accidentally intercepted one time, it would trigger his regen in like the one minute of just like hitting into his block would just instantly get regened um, and all of it would be for nothing so but doom doom can make light work of uh, gore depending on the node tigra can make light work of them just really depends on I, I, I bet Rentra would mess him up pretty good too. But um, yeah, it just really depends on what node he's on. But he can be pretty deadly, that's for sure. Disorients are nasty. Joe hitting hard. All right. All right, we're going to go in with Tigra. We're going to throw on some pre fights from Mr. Fantastic, because why not? I feel like Tiger is like the ultimate counter to Gallon. Mine's un my Tiger's unawakened. We can get him over here into the corner.
to get them throwing some special ones. And then we just dash in, hold, and then heavy spam. Dash in, hold, more spam of the heavy. Go. We got two senses up now because mine's unawakened. Throw another special. All right, we're gonna get to a special two here. And he did. He's not gonna survive that, right? Nope. And I'm not very good with Tigra, so if I can do that, pretty much anybody can do that. All right, let's try Rentra. All right, we're gonna back, let's see, replay. And then let's go exit, team select. And then we're gonna go, we're gonna drop those two guys. No, we're gonna drop, bring back She-Hulk. And then we're gonna bring in Rentra. And synergy wise, that one it could actually be. Let's do this. Let's throw on Taskmaster just for the extra duration. And then let's throw in. Spidey. Begin. Do we have any potions anywhere? We got another one in that same path. Oh, here's one. Let's go down to there, wherever that is, to the Chavez. Do something different. What is on this one? Unstoppable? Okay. Sure, let's do it. We got... We got, uh... She-Hulk. Here, let's throw on Mr. Fan. Petrify. And She-Hulk. Let's go. How is your guys' Alliance War season going? Are you guys... How hard are you hitting it? We had a, we had a bad start, but we are... Um, we're getting into things now. We lost our first two, but we've won our last three. Look at this cheese. If he could only throw a special to get, uh, if he could only throw a special to get stunned, it'd be cool to see how much damage he would take. There we go. Is it 22 hour EQ? Yeah, that's why I'm doing it. I just need like a couple runs of this. It's like 7k per run, and I've done everything so. All right, let's go Spidey. So they can get an unstoppable. Spidey can only counter that if he gets a special three off to get the slow. And they're stun immune, right? Yes, they're stun immune. slow but we're gonna push in a special three now we can throw it yeah 22 hour EQ gotta get my units 
after I've done everything. I think there was a couple days where I did a little bit extra, more than I normally would. So when I, today, and I think this, this month has gone long. This month is a long month. It's like a five week month over the, a, four, a normal four week month. Um, all right, let's just use She-Hulk. I should have put on a Petrify, but we get the Power Stings. So we can get the knockdown. There we go. We're gonna see some power stings on this one. Uh, game freeze. Man. All right, we got some furies going. Come on, throw it. I don't know how much of that is power sting. We're not enough. Didn't kill him. 15 furies. Come on, throw it. Yeah, 37k power sting. I love the I love the power stings. I love how they just throw that special and they just die. They just tip on over and say, maybe next time. It's one of my fa it's one of my favorite synergies. Definitely should have put a petrify on this this chick. I have an Alliance War video coming up. I think it's the next one. <sighs> this girl gave me some troubles. And it was stupid. Good. Do the catalyst dailies pay well? Um, never checked. Do they? Do they even pay? Do they? I know. I know the um, this month's side quest does does give you. Um, I don't know. We'll have, we'll have to check that out. We'll tr we'll try that after this is over. I don't think I've ever considered the uh, daily quests to. Um, give any points but they they might i don't think they're listed because i know like the side quest stuff is not listed um we're just gonna keep she she beast in this stuff um because i know it was back in i don't know april they had like the side quest that you could just do and it was just like three energy or something like that and you got the completion points. I know I used that on my um, my mini accounts. Throw it. Oh, didn't quite kill. There we go. But yeah, we sh I should I should go check that. I should go test that out. I have energy to spare. For sure. Alright, She-Hulk or She-Hulk versus Scarlet Witch. I wish I could get a Scarlet Witch. I wish they put out another Sigil Witch arena. Because then I could get enough. If I could win it again, go two times in the one to five percent, then I could en end up earning enough credits to get a six star sigil witch. Cause like right now I'm right around a hundred credits or something like that. They are in the first of the list. They are in the list. Yeah. They're first in the list on how to get points. Okay. I'll have to take a quick, leap, quick, quick look right after this is done. All right, we're gonna go Rentra. Stacked up to 50. 
Chi charges with Shang. He does a lot of damage. Yes, he does do a lot of damage. All right, we're just gonna throw on pre fights just cause. And they will. They all will help. Debuff Siphon's gonna put extra damage on the ruptures. Um. Uh, Petrify is not going to do anything, but the suppress will do some do some work. I got to be careful on on my how many times I parry. Oops. I was trying to connect them. Uh, no, I was trying to refresh all of those debuffs. Let's see how hard is this gonna hit. Mm, not crazy hard. All right, needs to throw a special while he's got neutralize up, please. gonna hit 18 ruptures 90 something K that wasn't too bad Ooh, can we get to a special two yes please kill him Probably gonna kill me. Mm, maybe, maybe. Oh, I survived. Nice. Oh, harvest completed. He was like 1% or something very close. I was trying to get to my special two. All right, let's finish with Taskmaster. Bring it home, Synergy Partner. A block. Uh, unstoppable for me, not for you. There we go. Alright, so let's go look at these points. So I know we get 7,000, if I remember right, 7,000 for 3.2 cav. And it's almost a full energy. It's like, it's somewhere between 60 and 70 energy. So. Expert gives 2,000. It's not a lot. Oh, the Catalyst Quest. Okay. Do I get that? Do I, I wonder if I get those points if I auto-complete. Let's try it. So I'm at 17.5. So if I go do like the tier three, I should get nine, 900 points. Let's see. Let's see if it'll give it to me. No, wrong spot. Right here. So 900 points for this one. If I auto complete it, I gotta get some energy. Use, use, auto complete. Now is that 17.5? Does that give me points? No. That's lame. But if I finish this, let's just stroll right through this one. It should get me to 900 points. So I should be at what? 17.5, 18.4. Let's try. I feel like I'm always in need of um, of some tier three.
No cav EQ. For me, next one, farming potions, get through pack six. You. Yeah, I hear ya. Personally, I always feel like getting the temporary quests done and knocked out quickly is probably more beneficial in the long run than um, the permanent content. Permanent content can always wait. But, uh... Yeah, if you want to get your first rank three, I can see that. But at the same time, rank twos, they can still they can still put in some work. But I guess you're gonna be trying to be pushing for Thronebreaker. So you want heavy enough for this? doesn't this AI is stupid come on there we go let's see guys in my alliance showing off their little um, stuff for the weekly boxes that they get through the Sunday offers, the little stamp stuff. Hmm. Hope to get Thronebreaker. Still going to rank up five stars? Yeah, I'll rank... I'll, I, if the five star is gonna help you out, definitely rank them up. For me, I'm gonna try to wait as long as possible unless I really need something. All right, so I was at 17.5, so now I should be at 18.4. Let's see, 18.4. Yeah. Okay. So you get. It's really too bad you don't get the completion points for just auto-completing it. I mean, it's pretty much the same thing going on right now. Now, I, want, I wonder how many points the... Um, the side quest gives because i don't the side quest i don't think is listed but i think i think somebody i think there was a guy in my alliance that said that it actually gave points but 900 points for how much energy this costs it's not a good it's not a good value but i'll do this just to get a couple tier three alphas because I don't really get those anywhere else in the game besides this quest because like the daily events and stuff they don't have those in here for paragons i wish there was a little bit easier way to get them somewhere else but it's not really need to rework the points in the event quest? I think so. I think so. Solidus, you're the third guy. Um, from last week for my birthday stream, I never got you to reply or to send an email to my 30k units at gmail 
for getting your mailing address to send you the um, Tigra sticker. It is a huge hassle compared to the others. I mean, I always, I always get it, um, but it is the one that needs like the most planning, coordination, you know, like my farming stuff is oriented around being able to do all of the all of the quests and stuff it's just yeah it's it, it's annoying for sure well if it's just like hero use or arena you know i can get those done easily and then what's the third one uh well yeah level up yeah that's the easiest one Come on, game. Come on. Oh, we're gonna get disconnect. Try to get the units, but it's normally like once a month I do it. Yeah, I do it every four days. Like I get, I get every four days. There's a few times where I'll miss a 22 hour solo event but it's not often come on game I might just have to force close in a second yeah it's very restrictive extremely restrictive like what I do to be able to do it it's definitely um, probably not uh, healthy <laughs> it's 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 there's just a lot all right I'm just gonna force close this Bring up control center, chance to reconnect. Yeah, I'll just I'll just reset. The fight took like two seconds, so it's not that big of a deal. And I might get a restart, or maybe it can't maybe it will count. Nope. That's right, we can we can kill a 2k Elsa again. Oh, come on, took more than one combo? Come on, Rintra. What are my thoughts on the 25% TCC? Uh, or the T6? Um, man, you know, I thought... I thought the, um... The speed in which we've been getting all these rank fours have gone a lot faster than I was expecting. Um, and I'm, I'm actually quite surprised that, have I done the EOP fights? Yes, I did. So I, I'll talk about that in a second, but um, like, I, I don't know. I, I'm surprised that we're getting T6. Now it's obviously not enough to, to get a rank five, but, um, Mm. With the gifting event, whatever that's going to be, I know gifting's canceled and they're going to replace it with basically go buy a bunch of stuff during Christmas, crystals and whatever. Um, if they put T6 in, it would not surprise me if some mega whale out there bought enough to get... A rank five it would not surprise me all right what were we gonna look at oh yeah we're gonna look at so here in EQ so now I'm at what 19.3 or something yes yeah, so we're at 19.3 let's go into the side quest uh, let's sure let's just take this team this will work we can just go straight up the middle right 
Yeah, and then, because in this, do they show, they don't show anything about side quest stuff. Just event quests and then the dailies. So I'm curious how many points we're at 19.3. Let's go straight up the middle. Use a refill. Let's see. I'm worried for gifting yourself. I'm worried for gifting yourself event that it could make BGs unachievable for top ranks. Hmm. Some will have a rank buy by the end of the rank holiday rewards yeah I that's what I see which to me is kind of crazy because I feel like once you start getting to rank fives you know I know that they, I know that they say they're gonna bring out um, uh, the artifacts or whatever they call it the relics um, hey look there's the undermine coat hanger there's the undermine Gore does have it. Oh, I should have thrown that off. I need to get this guy awakened. Oops. So that I can... Um... Mm, I did not want that. So I can get that power gain. Because I feel like without the awakening, getting to special 2 in time on that first cycle, it's it's difficult oh, I wasn't paying attention oops um, free to play five months to three to six months after I don't know we're just we're just <laughs> I don't even know what happened there I took a bunch of hits rent trials weird I yeah, Rintro's weird, let's just say that. <coughs> Alright, let's go. Yeah, he's super tanky. I, I sometimes I just don't understand why he doesn't take the damage. I know it's with deals with like his root and stuff like that. But um special you can't just hit into your block oops oops there we go um, getting to s2 with rupture don't you need to land a heavier two probably I feel like without any heavies or anything like that, it just it just doesn't happen. Here, let's go, let's go Rentra again on this one. Let's see if we can't get there. Because I always feel like it's just short. But with that power gain, it wouldn't be just short. Alright, there's a heavy. And I'm doing lots of lights. Alright, light attacks. Hmm. I'm just gonna throw this. Yeah, I lost my charges. Woo! Still killed. Yeah. Alright, man. Yeah, email me up. Hit me up with and I'll get that sent out. Tiger is waiting in an envelope for you. Just need a just need an address. You had this set up for interest more about isn't it more about ruptures than charges? But isn't it hold up, so let's look at this for a second. I thought, and maybe I'm mistaken. Where is my browser? This one. And then we go to Aunt May. 
And we go to Rentra. Because I thought you do more damage with your ruptures based on your mystical charges. So, special two. So on special activation, pause all ruptures for four seconds. The final hit of this attack gains 1400 attack per rupture on the opponent and removes all ruptures, rupture timer, and mystical charges. Uh, so where are the mystical charges? Is this one? Let's see. Oh, so no, it's more just about being unblockable, unstoppable, stun immune, all that kind of stuff. So yeah, it doesn't really matter, huh? It matters more about the ruptures. Okay, well, that's good to know. All right, well, let's go destroy this Rintra, or this Gallon with Rintra. So we got Bubble Shield, Specialist 2. All right, let's go. Let's see, we can't just blast through this guy. Unblockable, kill him. Oof, nothing. What? That did like nothing. Let's unblock all this garbage while we're rooted. Is, is it because it's energy that I'm not doing damage? No, oh, he's unblockable. Okay. I'm not sure where that came from. I had I had neutralize up. No damage. It's got to be because of um Whatever the note is. Second hit is energy, yeah. And it's got like high energy diet or something like that. All right, so let's go back. So now I had 19.3. How many points did I get for that? If any, none. Hmm, so maybe I was wrong. So I did that for nothing. All right, I just need to do like, what? Two more pass and 3.2 and I'm good. No, not this, not this. Event quest. Cav 3.2. Yeah. Alright, so... Who else could I use for Rintra? I'm gonna use Sim. Drop those. Uh... Let's go with this team. All right, any revives, potions? There's one. There's one on this path. What's on this path? Sure, we'll go down this one. I hear a champ called Herc is okay. You can try him. Hey, I, hey, Louie. I actually did. I actually did my uh, cosmic run on. Where is this one? How do I get? How do I get to there? No, 
Where's the portals? Portals. Where does this one go? Okay, that one goes to the boss. Is it this one? No, that one goes to the boss. How do I get over to this whole cluster? Is it this one? No. I'm so confused. Okay, it's that one. Ew, Nova? Alright, let's see. Alright, let's go. We'll still hit it up. Hulk Buster is at the end of the path? Yeah. Alright, so... This has got the power gain. It's got whenever the attacker gains a bar, defender gains regen buff. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Whatever. You just gotta watch out for the auto blocks. Not auto fight. What's up with that? I don't want auto fight. Let's get him over to the corner over here. lucky there. Gonna block it because I don't know how to evade it. Ooh! Stick to the special one. Stick to the special one. Ooh. What? Come on. Block. Work. Not a good way to start the path. Autoplay is on, yeah, no. I know. I went autoplay to, I think, to move, but. All right, throw a special and die, thank you. Hulk. Let's go put a petrify on to help. Okay, we got that refreshed. I'm gonna refresh it again. Throw a special. Hmm, and I missed it. Not a lot left. That's alright. We're gonna keep going with She-Hulk until she did. If she's gonna die. Although I don't think I could really use her on Hulkbuster. I think Hulkbuster probably would shock her to death. Although we could put on a debuff siphon. I'm not sure if it's gonna be enough though for a beefy Hulkbuster. Nine days? Yeah, you know, the one thing I had posted about this and somebody corrected me. I'm surprised it's in nine days. Every act and variant release has always been two weeks after EQ has been launched. And then this one is uh, only one week after. Going with She-Hulk. OK, 
can't hit into the block. Throw you a special one. Thank you. Refresh those furies. Thank you. Come on, my furies, come on. I guess I got some of the passive ones from the node. for seven more days yeah I'll be ready I mean you look at my refills look at my refills I have 64 no 61 refills I have a few all right we're gonna see if she Hulk can do this one I'm not sure I might die to shock but we're gonna throw on debuff siphon We can get an armor break plus the shock. We might be able to willpower heal. We'll see. Nine percent. Hmm. Oh, Mr. Perry. Curious if 8.1 changed much. Yeah, since they had a lot more data from bribing us to 100% it. I actually, I had issues with um, getting on to the beta. I only did a little bit of it. Um, let's put on all we can. Do I only have two? Yeah, I only have two. Um, but... Um, I think I did all of the first chapter, and then I think I did like one path in 8.1.2 and 3, and I didn't have time after that. And I got a I got a decent amount of shards, but I ended up not getting the max amount. Twelve hundred units, lots of revives. Yeah, I almost have nineteen thousand units and a ton of revives. I'm gonna try to plan to not use many. I re I really like it when the new content is released because I like the planning aspect of it and trying to strategize, come up with something that works for the path. And you know, how I strategize and plan for paths is, is probably different than some people, because I, you know, Ghost, I don't even think about ever really using Ghost. Hercules, I mean, I might, I might use him a little bit, but he's not gonna be one of the top picks on my um, lists for picking out champs for the pass but um, yeah I, I really do like the new content so it should be fun and I'm gonna try to blast it out I don't know that I'm gonna stream it for me I kind of just like my peace and quiet for that kind of stuff and planning it and then just kind of voice overing while I play and then um, then just kind of posting it as soon as I get a path done all right so we got limber and all this stuff I got max MD the staggers yeah staggers still work I just can't nullify I 
And do I push him to which special? Here, let's throw this. Got a protection up. I don't even know what a special three does. Maybe I'll push into special three with protection up. Yeah, let's go for it. So I should only do like 5%, so we're at 88. I don't know if it does any energy damage or anything else. Uh, it took 15%. All right, he is harvesting. Boom, boom, boom. Boom, boom, boom. We got harvested or something. Just took a bunch of damage. That harvest ended. That's what it was. Unstoppable. Let's see, but I clearly say nullify when a stagger is used. Yeah. Oh, that was okay. I, sh I wasn't ready for him getting all his stuff. And going unstoppable. Venom pool. Actually, I'm gonna. Do I have to do? I need. I'm gonna try Venom pool again. Cause I can just spam special ones and just num num. That's not a nullify. I don't think I've ever seen anybody try to use him much. Okay, let's just go same team. Cause I think I need one more path. No, I'm gonna need more than one. He is, is he described as not losing mass when hit by a special while harvest is on? Uh, let's check. I don't know. Let's see. Gallon, where are you at? Right here. Harvest activates when he reaches 100 or more. 14 seconds. He consumes all planetary mass when it's consumed. When it's active, he gains an unstoppable and regen. If Gallon performs a special attack while the harvest is active, it becomes unblockable and the harvest ends burst damage. Let's see. Whenever Gallon is knocked down by a special attack, he loses 30 planetary mass so I don't know I didn't I wasn't really paying attention to his mass and stuff but with my special twos was I not dropping his mass planetary mass I, that's what you're asking I'm assuming coat hanger if you make a guide for 8.1 I have an idea for you so when you make the thumbnail why don't you put the champs in the path instead of the champs for the path. I hope you understand what I mean. I do understand what you mean. Yeah, he wasn't losing mass. Yeah. I guess so. I don't think that's in his description. What's his sig ability? Sig ability. While harvest is active, he becomes stun immune and deals a burst damage whenever Gallon gains any amount of planetary mass this damage scales with base attack only hmm I do Louie I do know what you mean and I will definitely take that into consideration maybe I'll put both on and I don't really I mean I don't really call them guides let's see what is this path we haven't done this one. Doesn't look like there's any EMP mod. No, I don't want to do that one. Uh, no, here, we'll just go A. You just gotta do one more path. This should go pretty quick. I 
But yeah, I get it. I get what you're saying, Louie. You want to see who's on the who's on the path that has EMP or whatever whatever I'm doing, not not just the champs that I used on the team. Maybe I'll maybe I'll try to think of a way to to put both um, on that makes sense. Maybe even like a matchup, something or other. I don't know. I'm trying to think of. I, for me, like the one thing that I do like about my thumbnails that I do is it usually shows like what champs I use, which is how I was doing the um, the thumbnails for all like my questing stuff. But then like on my Alliance War videos, I show both my attackers and who I'm like who I'm up against and it at least that really helps me because I'm like a picture picture guy associate memories and stuff with pictures um, so when somebody says hey does somebody does somebody know what happens in this fight I'm like oh I've done that before or oh I've had an alliance mate do that before and I put it in a video and it's easy to to find my video just from that thumbnail You can see NCO, MCOC, and your MCOC noob. I'm, I'm assuming that was a typo. Much easier to know what path the video is about. I think so. I think I know what you're talking about. Let's see, if I go and uh, if I go to YouTube and um, where is MCOC noob? Somewhere in here, somewhere. He's somewhere in there. Let me see. MCOC noob. So you're talking about, yeah, you're talking about like this. Um, let's see, playlist. I'm sure he has like a, like this. Something like that, where you're doing those champs. Yeah, it's something to consider. I think I can, I think I can, I don't want, you know, I don't, I do my own thing, but definitely I think, I think I should be considering like who is on the path for, um, for my thumbnails. I'll take it into consideration. And I, the other thing is, it does take a lot of time to do detailed thumbnails like that. It takes a lot. It does take more effort to do like um, I don't know another six images, but maybe I can put together some type of template that would that would work that I could just kind of drag and drop all my little uh, images that I have on my computer for dealing with all of the champs. Well, it's our special, thank you. Oops. But I will take your suggestion and I will probably do it in some way, shape, or form. Because it is a good one. And I've and I've considered it I've considered it prior to, to this, but I just gotta, I gotta put some time and thought into it to make sure I can do it quickly and to make sure it looks good and it matches with what I would do. Okay. 
All right, we're almost done. I think, I think this might be the last path that I need to do. If not, I can do like a shorter path. That could almost be auto-fighted. What time is it? It's almost five o'clock. All right. Thousand crit. That was juicy. I just removed my team. I don't know that I want to remove my team because I like to give people a little preview of what I'm going to be doing. Like one one thing that one thing that I that I try to do, if this makes sense, but I try to be very transparent as what's going to be in my videos. I don't like to do a lot of clickbaity crap because I don't want to waste anybody's time, and I don't do a lot of like flashy videos to begin with. But um, like for me, if I saw a video. If I saw one of my thumbnails on somebody else's, or one of my style where I have, hey, I'm gonna use these attackers. So like, for example, like if I saw a thumbnail where it was doing um, a boss solo, like mo let's just talk about the Eternity of Pain. Like if there was an Eternity of Pain solo and it was done with Black Widow Deadly Origin, to be honest, I would probably not click on it um and maybe i would but generally speaking i probably wouldn't because one i can already envision what she can do but i just don't have her and i don't have her i have her as like a five star rank one i don't have her as a six star so like the video doesn't have a lot of relevancy towards what i would be doing and so I just don't need to watch it. Um, now somebody said, oh, there's this amazing, super awesome solo, and it was just against MODOK, and um, and they kind of clickbaited it up, spiced, spiced up the picture or whatever, but I didn't know who it was, and then I go click on it, and then I saw Black Widow Deadly Origin, I'd be like, eh, I'd probably not watch it almost immediately. I don't know if that makes any sense, what I'm saying. But I just like to be like, you know, I, I realize at the same time, like a lot of the stuff that I use is maybe not the traditional, you know, Hercules, Ghost, Corvus, whatever stuff. I like to use a lot of different things. Um, and I like my I like my thing and other champs like that. And I realize that other people don't like that so like if there was if there was somebody that was looking for help for 8.1 and I went and used thing like they're not gonna like I don't want them to click on my video and be like oh he soloed that with thing but guess what I don't have a thing and like I don't want him there's just like I don't need views and clicks and stuff like that like if it's gonna if it's gonna help you then come and watch my video and hopefully it will help but like, if you don't have the champ, like I don't want you to be watching my video and be like, well, that didn't help me, if that makes any sense. Let's see. auto fighted it. auto fighted it. Did I say that? <laughs> All right, we're gonna see if we can num num this guy. I'm probably gonna get harvested and wrecked but we're gonna see if we can't try to keep some of his buffs and stuff in control. Ooh, 
he's got a lot of mass on there. See, I don't know if I can get enough. Get the unstoppable. I don't know if I can get enough buffs and stuff. To keep him in check. What I needed, I probably should have um, had a... Alright, so he just... What is that that he has? What is this? Intensify buff all of your bonus. Okay, sure. Let's get rid of a couple of those. It's too bad I can't get any regens. Hey, did I dex that? I dexed. Uh, at least I dexed part of it. Unstoppable? No. Yeah. There we go. I'm gonna get wrecked on this next special two activation. Yep. Dang. Harvest complete. Well, I, th I thought that that did okay. I think. I need some type of energy power gain. Said auto fight a new past per participle of fight deserves an extra ed. What? <laughs> All right, let's go. Let's just go sim. Let's just kill him with sim. Need more power gain with Venom Pool, I think. Auto fought. <laughs> yeah, I'm right there with you, Louie. I'm not sure what's going on with the um, coat hanger and his auto fight stuff. All right, we're gonna get boom, boom, boom. Damage is just stupid. I feel like there's not enough there's not enough champs in the game to bypass that, but I'm sure there'll be more introduced. I mean there's there's a handful. And blade is a decent option. Alright, so I is that enough points? Please be enough points. Am I done with EQ for this month? Please? Oh, 700 points. All right. Um, where can I get 700 points? Without doing that, let's see. Ch -ch -ch beginner, beginner. No, no. Let's go, what? Heroic 3 point, or 1.1. 1. 1. No, heroic 1.2. Masters. Masters 1.1. 1. 1. Here we go. All right, I'm just gonna go here. We're gonna do this. Edit team. We're gonna go Doom, Surfer, Hercules. Uh, we'll leave out Torch. We're just gonna go Rank, Rank Force. We're gonna go Auto Fight. Any items? Nope. Let's just go straight up the middle. We're making new words. They deserve more letters at all. All right. Um. You don't need them. Never mind. The team is great. Keep going. Yeah. These guys, these guys are going to steamroll, get my thousand points, and finish the last milestone.
So yeah, I'll think about it. I'm gonna, I'm gonna, to, I'll see if I can't plan something ahead of time before 8.1 comes out and have some, um, like a template, update my template that I use where I can drag and drop profiles of champs or whatnot in. That's a good idea. Who would be your first rank five other than Herc or Thing? You know, I think that's even just too far away to think about it, but I mean, um, I, I, I mean, one, one determining factor of that would be prestige. Probably, um, and then just I don't know because I feel like by the time I get a rank five, I mean, I would have thought at earliest it would have been like next year sometime that people would be getting rank fives, but um, I don't know. Seems like it's going to be at the end of this year, to be honest. So I feel like. Um, that's the case for me I mean with gifting I'm assuming gifting's not going to be kind to to my account um, in terms of progressing along with all the whales um, since my mini farming stuff will only give me consumables which probably based on what a consumable is I don't they don't really have a specific um, definition yet of what's going to be in those but uh, I think it's going to be stuff that I don't need but you can rest assured when gifting comes around I'm going to have some fun I have I have a few units and uh, we're going to have fun with them even if I can't get uh, GGC's from them let's see if you say fought it in <laughs> What accent does that mimic as saying farted? <laughs> farted. Fought, I say you farted. Um, <laughs> I don't know. Sounds kind of like English. Yeah, Northeastern USA, maybe. Sunspot or CGR rank 5? <laughs> say farted. It sounds like someone says farted. But with an accent, yeah, I fought, I fought it. I fought it, someone. <laughs> Look, right now I'm gonna fight Captain Br Britain, but after I fought it, huh? We're going to move on. Coat, I don't know what you're on, but it's good having you. It's good having you here on stream. <laughs> All right, here comes the thousand points. And we're going to finish our EQ 22 hour milestones. I wonder if I should just go back into EOP and use other champs that don't fit the objective. Like maybe just go in with my rank four um, torch and see how well he can do. He should do pretty pretty well. <laughs> just need to eat so low sugar, I guess. <laughs> Out of context for ten minutes. <laughs> It's all right. There's no context for the stream. We're just here doing some MCOC, having good times. Yeah, I understood. Yeah, I understood. All right, so we should be done with the milestone. And we got this. Okay. All right, so that's the seven hour. There's the... 22 hour.
Yeah, I speak many. I speak languages. English is not my only language. Summoner camp. We're almost to the end of the month with the summoner camp. <laughs> All right, let's. I want to try something. Let's go back into Eternity of Pain. And I'm just going to try Torch. And now that I'm familiar with the AI behavior, let's see if we can't. Um, can you this guy down? Because I don't know. Torch might. He might be on my. Um, week four team where we have to fight or week five or whatever it is we have to fight all the champs we're not going to put on pre-fight because we do want the incinerates or i don't know maybe it would be interesting to know if a um if oops whoops whoops that's right we can't parry on that first one interesting his incinerate I felt like um, sunspots and whoops incinerate um, got through the auto block and torches is not I'm gonna try to see if Nova Flames does not prevent the um, auto block or not. Whoops, I thought I dashed back. No. Nope. You speak Arabic and English? Arabic. Nice. I don't think I understand what you guys said, so I just said <laughs> that. I speak English and Korean. All right, hold on, let's restart. So let's see, let's go up to this. Let me read this description. Is it an incinerate effect or is it an actual debuff? Oh uh, no, it's a shock or incinerate debuff. So, but here, we're still gonna go flame on. Let's go flame on. We'll have to deal with the auto block, but let's see if we can't just sting him to death. Because I can't keep temperature up effectively on this fight. special but he didn't have a special all right let's get him aggressive get into the block I wish I could. Uh, I wish I could build up some smolder. 
You speak English and Kabam? Yeah. That's a that's a good that's a good language to know. Here we'll go we'll go one more we'll go one more try on this. I wish I could build up some smolder. I mean I technically can block some L1s. Maybe I'll maybe I'll try that a few times and just make sure that he's not unblockable. Just try to parry him. But I feel I'm gonna miss the unblockable part and then I'm gonna get wrecked by it. And then if he has a lot of if he has a lot of furies. gonna hurt Ooh, or kill I didn't try to block that one I just missed it I feel like there's just like so much aggressiveness that you gotta use in the playstyle for this without having an incinerator shock that it's I don't know I'm gonna try one more time I'm not sure who else I would think would be good that wouldn't fit the objectives. Has anybody have have any of you guys done any non-objective EOP Modoc fights? Just dash back on this dude. You can. I was. Hold on. We're gonna. We're gonna restart this. You haven't even done the fight. Well, I guess. Yeah. You're not. You're not Thronebreaker, right? So if you're not Thronebreaker, you do not have access. Which I think is really dumb. Like Cavalier and below. It's like, hey. They just like dangle this little carrot out there. Can you just dash back and... Let me try this again. Is Modok like a domino, killmonger, whatever, where you can just dash back and... I think so. I missed right there, but I think so. Hmm. I think so. I'm just late on that one. Come on, come at me. Come on, bro. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, all right. Well, you can. Oh, you are Thronebreaker. Or maybe who was who was I who was talking earlier that they had were doing seven point something or other for their first uh, maybe it was Kevin or somebody else somebody else was in the league. you haven't done it you got to do it let's see team select let me just look at some of my other champs had it. See, I would really like to use Surfer, but you gotta do the heavy knockdowns and stuff. Falcon would be kind of interesting. See, I don't have. That's one thing that my account lacks is like shock. I got incinerate champs, but shock dealing champs, they just like don't exist. They just don't exist. Magneto, can Mag- I wonder. Let's just use Magneto. Can you try out Falcon? Okay, I'm gonna, I'm gonna try out Falcon, but I'm gonna try out Magneto. I'm wondering if we can't bypass 
um, what you call it? Tranquility. Didn't work there, but it's 70% of the time, so maybe. Oh, let's see, we gotta we gotta throw a special now. Okay. No, we didn't bypass it there. We'll try a few times. have max um, whoops I don't have max pacify so um, I'm just gonna throw this so even if he was stunned when that happened and the tranquility happens, it wouldn't help me. Hmm, it doesn't seem like it's gonna bypass at all, which I'm kind of surprised. Oops. Kind of surprised that Magneto wouldn't, um, Bypass it. I mean, Magneto's definitely an option here, and it takes extra hits into the block for him to go unblockable. There we go. There, can we get. Oh, we got a nice dex on the special two. And I feel like for the most part, he is preventing the, um, oh shoot, the uh, damage for, not the damage, the power gain. Powerful power from afar. Oh, I'm dead. All right. Well, Magneto definitely is an option to consider for like the final week team. Because I didn't even play well and got half off on the first time. So let's see. What about? Hmm, Aegon would be interesting. Let's go try Falcon. See what we can do. Yeah, you can get to SP2, but I don't think you can get to SP3. Yeah, there's no way to get to SP3. Maybe with a synergy team, when you can put three champs on the team. Um, all right, let's see. Get locked on. Now he can still auto block even with locked on there's like a there's like a chance all right locked on doesn't go away that's good no well, I just got whacked Yeah, Falcon definitely works if I don't get hit.
Alright, he's super aggressive. Okay, now we can get that. Adrenaline. I'm in not even playing well, but um, Falcon definitely works. Just kind of get some furies on this dude. Oh, we're not when locked on is going on. We don't give him the um, the furies. So he's not going to go unblockable, which I kind of want him to do because I'd like that AI more. Well, there's about half. Hyperion using SP1s would work. I tried hype. I I well, I tried with my unawakened hype. Awakened might be a little bit better, but he reverses your your power gain on the special one. So Falcon's definitely an option. Here, let's try my domino. I don't know how her double medium will interact. I wonder if it's gonna be similar to like Elsa and all that. We shall see. Yeah, pretty much. Ugh, not get hit. Alright, let's try that again. That was stupid. CGR SP1, but the fight would be 15 minutes. Yeah, I mean, that's the thing. is like, you can use some incinerate champs, but... No, what am I doing? Not revive. Restart. Um... I feel like their access to incinerates is not as good as you would like. Like, it was kind of funny. So I took Elsa. Elsa is pretty good. I mean, oh my gosh. She can, she can put out that. I made him unblockable and tried to block. Um, but I could never really get in the flow with her all that well. I know there's been people that have soloed with her, but like then after doing it for like a half hour or so trying, I went in with one one tr first try with Masakre and I soloed without like any issues on the stream. And I'm like, oh, so like champs that just have access to the incinerate. And I don't know, it felt like torches, um, like how it, um, actually applied was a little bit oh come on oh come on I felt like it was different than some of the ones that I had used no, don't run in and tap into the block when he's got a special thing oh, we're gonna do domino one more time I'm gonna one more time. I see restart. My domino sig forty sixty. All right, let's see if we can't. not get intercepted see that double hit into the block is kind of annoying on the medium and maybe that's what was kind of throwing me off with using Elsa because I felt like I don't know maybe I had to mess around with it and try to pay more attention as to when the auto block will 
get ignored. See, like right there, that was ignored. I think it was because I was intercepting. But if you're not, I don't know, it just feels clunky. All right, boom. See, like right there, like I hit into the block. I don't know, I'm not gonna use domino anymore. Hit into the block with the double medium and then I get countered. I don't know. I don't wanna have to deal with the brain power it takes to make sure I always account for that, if that makes sense. Who else? Who else would be interesting? No, is his thing is is it? I know his things are evade, but is it auto block? True accuracy, but I think the true act well. Ignores, evade, and auto block. Let's give him a try. It's a passive true accuracy, but I don't know if that's gonna get shut off by the node. We will soon find out. Because it says, the attacker's true strike, true accuracy, and true sensibility suffer 100%. So yeah, I'm thinking this, he's not gonna work, but we'll find out really quick. Is medium and heavies. Yeah, not gonna work. Oh, snap. I feel like the flow on this guy is pretty decent. Sure, that wasn't unblockable. Ooh, and I missed that. And eh, no. Had I not get wrecked at the beginning. Yeah, he's. start I want to team select he doesn't bypass it though who else do I have I got Aegon I'm thinking about doing Aegon no kingpin can do some work black cat If I get my combo up enough. We can turn off a defensive ability accuracy. And if we have like the uh, sabotage on. Uh, sabotage adds 40%. Let's see, for each hit in Black Hat's combo meter, the opponent's defensive ability actually is reduced by 2%, or twice that against science opponents, up to maximum 60. All right, let's just try Black Cat. I haven't used her a lot. She's got some funky hits in her combo. I'm not sure how well that's gonna work with auto block if I do get auto blocked. Let's just give her a try.
And I need to make sure I don't get hit. I don't want to lose my combo. I don't have an awakened... Uh, there goes my combo. I don't have an awakened black cat to save my bacon. With the combo ch thingy that she gets. She's, she's got a weird hit into her into the block. Ooh, let's try again. Sounds like dinner. <laughs> what sounds like dinner? Background noise from me? All right, let's try this again. I wish mine was awake because I get that combo protector thingy. She's turning off the, um, whoa, 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 whoa. She's turning off the unblockable stuff. Which to me is not the best thing. Because I do want him to get that unblockable aggressive AI. No, don't auto block. Woo. All right, our combo is high. But it's only gonna be a 60% reduction. So he can still auto block me, which is kinda annoying. Gonna hold block. I'll throw the special too. Thank you. Oh, Stan. Oh, the dishes in the background. Yeah, I got. Yeah, you can hear that. The dishes in the background. Yeah, I have my door open in my office. Here, we're gonna try this one more time. I think Black Cat. I think I could probably get a decent, uh, I probably could get a solo with her. The sabotage debuff thing. We have to have the heist end and then have, oh, he's unblockable. Ooh. We have to have the heist end with the card on, I think the card on Modok. Because I think the other, other way to get the sabotage is to get to special two, which is a little bit more tricky to do. I'm surprised the, the mic can pick up that background noise. Tick me away, maybe. Oh, auto blocked again. Uh, 
Did I just stream on, I just stream on my MacBook. I got a MacBook Pro and it just has, I, I have no idea actually even where the, the microphone is on the computer because I don't have like an external one. So I'm just surprised they can pick all, pick up background, background stuff. All right, last time with Black Cat and then I'm gonna maybe try looking at a few others. Definitely can be done with Black Cat. I wish she, she was awakened. No, we're gonna do that, that sucked. This is the last try. Um, Rintron Black Cat, I've opened 18 featured crystals and I've gotten Black Cat once and Rintra once and then like 10 Jubilees and half a dozen or so Proxima Midnights and it's been really annoying. See the auto block there. Whoa, I just got uppercutted and I died. Well, I think she, I think she can work. And I think if you have a combo, if she's awakened, so much better because you can you can mess up once or twice or three times or several times which you know for me I could use that what else I wonder I'm just gonna try mr. fantastic can can I get him to get the careful study passive off in one go and I guess I could get hit by one special special one and if he but if he can if I can get him to throw three special ones I'm just let's, I'm gonna want to see how how that impacts like the damage output from getting maybe hit by a special one and we do also get the extra power gain need to get him to yeah, there's one no we got it we got to be hold on quit restart all right my goal is just to get it get a careful study passive one on on this guy exit restart I think I'm just gonna make him go hit into the block, make him go aggressive right as tranquility is resetting. Or right there. Na, 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 na. All right, he's gonna reset that and I'm gonna get hit, okay. All right, throw it. Throw it. Throw it. Oh, you. Okay, 
Okay, well there's two, so we just gotta get him to throw one more. <sighs> or get hit. Alright, that was stupid. And I forget, I have unblockable specials when I, um, get, or when I throw, since I don't have any, um, pre-fights being put, so I can just throw my specials whenever. Alright. There's one. Unblockable. There's two. Can reset. Okay, there's one. There's two. And throw it. Yeah. Now there's like no way possible to get oh, him to get to a special two twice. Mr. Fantastic, Fantastic is actually not doing too bad. Well, and I just tried to block an unblockable hit. Yeah, eat that. Auto block my unblockable sucker. See, I just got hit by that, and it did, like, nothing. And that was with all the Furies. Ooh. wasn't terrible. I got him what? 30 something percent? Almost 40 percent? What is that? 495 divided by 764? Yeah, 35 percent. It's not terrible. Yeah, was, that's an interesting option. I don't know. I don't think I have... I don't think I'm gonna go... Aegon or anything like that. Um, <laughs> I wish you could heavy in this fight. If you could heavy in this fight, there's a lot of interesting options. Kitty, like if you have Kitty with like uh, Tiger on the team, should be fun times. You being fully unblockable. Black Panther would be interesting. 
let's try let's just put black panther in once we're gonna do black panther and then i'm gonna go into the arena and get a get a little bit of uh units from i think like the tier four basic arena it takes a couple rounds to get 30 units this is just a rank four Black Panther. I wish I had him as a six star as well. He's just really smooth. Oof. Oh, I just totally got whacked. Ooh, I am unblockable. When are you ranking up that six star Jubilee? Probably not anytime soon. We already have a we already have a rank four in our battle group. Alright. That was just messing around. Black, uh, Black Panther definitely could work. He definitely could work. Especially if he was ranked up. Be easier to get some more damage. Alright, where's this arena? What's going on, McLeod? Bugman, what's going on? Whoa, what is up with the... Oh, there it goes. Took a minute for the images to show up. Um, McLeod, I went in and I was... So I did my Eternity of Pain stuff, but on my, fir on my first try with Masakre, I got a pretty dang clean solo. Um, and then I used Sunspot and Hercules as my other two, but I didn't get solos. I used, I used a couple revives. So we're just gonna do a couple rounds to um, get the 30 units from this. I don't need the tier um, tier four basic. You opened two Nexus calves and got a six star Odin and a six star Misty Knight? Dude, well, somebody's having a good day. That's awesome. I wish, I wish I had an Odin. Um, I have, um, I have a rank four, four star Odin. That's what I got. <laughs> That's all I got. I don't have the five star version or the six star version. Um, I wish I had an Odin. And I do, ha I do have a Misty. She's actually... I don't use her a lot. I have her at rank two on Awakened, um, but she's gonna have her uses uses that uh, unblockable, plus like the guaranteed crits, and you can kind of just keep her that way. I think it's gonna be really useful. You also only had the four star before today. Well, man, congrats! Seriously, like one Odin's actually a really good champ. And then two, the pre-fights are really clutch for a lot of things. Whether you're helping out in Alliance War or possibly in Alliance Quest or just in your regular questing and stuff, like those pre-fights are legit. And I don't have access to, using, to use them in Act 8 right now, which is really annoying um, because you can't bring in a, anything lower than a five star. So I don't have an Odin to throw in. Like I didn't get to use Odin at all in Act 7. I probably would have in some spots. 
And then Gallon. Like, I want to get him as something as well because it will be cool to put on his, uh, his pre-fight to make, um, whatever you call it, the, um, what is that called? A herald? Stop throwing mediums. There we go, so I can parry you. Mm, too close. Oh, game freeze. Oh, he died. Yeah, I've made, I've, I've uh, ran um, Silver Surfer in, in in incursions with. I brought my team in was my rank four Silver Surfer, and then I brought in my four star Odin and my four star Herald into Zone Eight. You have to win the first fight or whatever with um, Gallon. But I just remember, like, I, I was just doing a random, and they're like, oh, are you trying to show off your surfer? I'm like, ah, I'm just trying to have some fun. But, like, the, the pre-fights, Odin pre-fights, plus the, the Herald pre-fight, dude, it juiced up Silver Surfer like crazy, plus all the other incursion hacks that you can get. It was a lot of fun. And I've only, I've only done that with, with Surfer thus far, but there's going to be a lot of cosmic champs that you can do some crazy stuff with. <laughs> so I think we're just going to get to... Come on, AI. The AI in these in these first couple of arenas before you get your infinite streak can be super annoying sometimes. Let's go. Toxic armor. There we go. Come on, game. There we go. They're just so passive. Uh, McLeod says, gotta get Hulkling to use in incursions. Dude, I'm telling you, my... Let me show you this. I don't know. I, I, think, I, I think you've seen it. Uh, let's see. Six star featured. Um, is it this one? No, it's not that one. It's this one. It's this one. Um, can I show that one? So this has been my featured polls. Let me make it bigger. I mean, look at that. While I got Arena going here, I'm going to go... I make it maybe a little bit smaller, but do my next round. But that's what I've gotten on my arena pulls, and it has been absolutely big pile of dog dookie. And that's saying it nicely because I've opened up 18 and I've gotten two. You know, there's 25% of the pool it are the new champs. Whoops. Um, and my percent of pulling the new ones is 2 out of 18. What's that, like 11% or something like that? Yeah, 11.11%. So I'm under half. I mean, technically I should have gotten, you know, 18 times 25% is... I should have had, yeah, should have at least 4 
five on average. And I know RNG doesn't work like that, but man, it has been. And then all the ones that I've gotten, like, okay, I awaken my Korg. Korg, that's nice. Max Sig Crystal on thing. Didn't need that, but whatever. Uh, four, four Jubilees when I already had her awakened. Yeah, no thanks. Uh, Corvus, I don't need anything on Corvus. Extra 40 sigs on Proxima, no thanks. Extra 20 sigs on an awakened Dormammu, no thanks. It's just been, it's just been bad. It's just been really bad and frustrating. But yeah, I want Hulkling, I want Scorpion, Omega Sentinel, Wong, Guardian. I could use, I could use an Awakening on Guardian. Even Darkhawk, give me Darkhawk, even, give me, give me the Invisible Drax for crying out loud. Like, ugh. And I'm having a hard time wondering if I should just, uh, just give up and start saving for the next one or what. I don't know, we'll see. We'll see. Cloud, I heard we got DSVG for this next war. Should be fun. Because <laughs> I think they are doing normal, normal warring. Should, it should be a good war. I think so. Mm. You know, I, you know, I didn't try with uh, Mojo. How good would Mojo be against Gallon? Whereas a lot of his buffs. They don't have a duration. Let's see. Do we just need to get to 250? Or do we gotta get to the next one? I can't remember. Let's see. Hopefully it's just this round. If there's one of I can't remember which one's which, but there's one of the arenas where you have to get to like 500 k Gallons buffs don't expire. Yeah. Well, if they don't expire. Oh look, here we go. Just hold. Got the little uh, heavy duel going on right now. And Quake wins. Yeah, Quake wins. Mojo throws a lot of specials though. Yeah. 
D doesn't uh, Galen's Furies, don't they have a duration? I think like his, I'm not even sure which, I don't have Galen, so I haven't really, well, I do have a four star Galen that I've used once or twice, but. points or is it this arena where you need to get to 500,000 let's see there's the units yeah this is the one all right they do expire and he has unstop and has okay. So Mojo would be an interesting option to use to counter Gallon. Probably should have considered trying him. You don't get the catalyst? No. Why would I get the catalyst? I ain't got time for that. I don't think I've gotten a catalyst in the tier one alpha, tier four basic, or tier four class um, since the solo crystals, I think. So, I mean, it's been like two, three years. I mean, I used to a long time ago, but I think it's when they when they changed up the arenas, um, I just stopped. I think with like the daily crystals and the solo events, um, I just don't need them. I mean, I sell the tier one alphas all the time. Um, and I've, often actually sold uh, a number of tier 4 basics. I don't sell those as much. I try to use them a little bit here and there. Is she going to throw a special or what? Let's just go for it. Come on, stop being annoying. It's the only way you can level up. I mean, how much level up do you I I normally hit the unit one. And, you know, there'll be some times where I'll get to, like, a hundred thousand or whatever and get the one to ten percent but I normally don't try you know I get to the forty eight thousand or so and then whatever else a little bit above that and I just call it good and I always have champs I mean like my my champion roster rating is not all that high but if I actually did you know I have the gold I have the ISO if I if I rank them up then sure I could have a much higher like ranking and or total champion rating and all that but for what purpose like I yeah I mean if I need a champ to test with I'll rank them up but other than that they kind of just sit there for a while I feel like my game's hold on I'm gonna do a quick reset because I feel like my game is uh lagging But yeah, I don't I don't do the tier four basic arena milestones. I haven't in a long, long time. I just get the, the units and then I jet. I wish I wish Kabam would uh make like a tier four. Not tier four, a tier five arena or something. Okay, come on, game. Load up. 
I can't rank without T4B unless they are new from Arena. Hmm. Oh, there we go. We had a new calendar day. Oh, this really makes me mad. These these dailies. Super awesome. But I'll tell you what, I can't I can't count how many I've lost because of claiming late. Yeah, all four stars are 440 and five stars, two, uh, 345, 245. I don't, I don't use the catalyst, the class on um, the five stars unless I'm gonna rank them up. I mean, I'll get some to like rank four here and there. Like I have a Omega Sentinel, she's one of the newer ones that's rank four. But it's been a while since I've done a rank five five star. But yeah, most of mine. I don't know. I'm just I'm in no hurry to get them ranked up, and I have lots to rank. I just kind of take my time. I'm in no hurry. I'll I'll rank up some of the newer ones um, that I get from the arena, the four stars to like 440, pretty quick. If I feel like I need to duel them and be ready for them for like war. 345? Let's see, Neen. You're looking to try new mobile games with multiplayer or alliances or any game to progress rosters. Okay. Well, the only good game I know about how to do that is MCOC. So I really don't play other games. Which some may say that's dumb, but I just really like this game. Come on, AI. Come on. Hit me to my block. There we go. <laughs> Injustice Mobile is pretty good, but it's too boring. It's pretty good, but too boring. What's up? Um, dinner's ready. Dinner's ready? Okay, I will be there in one minute. Two minutes, one minute. Oh, I wanted to go to the park after dinner. You wanna to go to park after dinner? Okay, yeah. we can do that. But can you sit by me again? Sit by you where? At the dinner table. At the dinner table? Yeah, if you want me to. <laughs> okay. I'll be there in just a second. Once I get to 500,000. You can't even dash back in, in, in Injustice? I mean, I, I I don't even know about that game. I mean, I've heard of it. I don't think I've ever actually seen it. Come on, AI. See, and this is why I, these first couple fights, oh, I just stole my power. She was going to get smashed with a special. There we go. Two more wrap, two more fights, and then we're gonna be done. I think I'm gonna wrap it up. Daughter says dinner is ready. Time to eat. Man thing is so fun with Mystic Dispersion. Boom. Dead. Max MD makes that dude an animal. This is not a good matchup. Can't armor break, can't bleed. I can't even get rid of my crowd excitement to get back my fury on the special two. This guy is dead. It might take it might take another 30 hits. Come on. Come on, AI. Come on. 
What? How did that whiff? It connected. Hmm, that was weird. Come on, kill him. Thank you. Thank you. Problem in Injustice is gold. You need it for basically everything. Takes too long. That sounds like MCOC. I know there's a lot of gold issues at the moment. All right, so we got... We got our units. Boom. Got it. And then we say goodbye to this arena. All right, fellas. Um... I think I'm going to call it a stream. I've been going for way too long. Four and a half hours. Holy shnikes. All right. Well, thanks for everyone stopping by. Coat Hanger, McLeod, Neen, uh, Louie, everybody that's been in the stream. There's been a lot of you. Appreciate you guys. Thanks for watching. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.